Hey guys, uh, this week we're talking about school and I've changed my Netflix. Oh, okay. Um. <sighs> I'm watching Glee. Um, okay. Talk about school and being gay and your friends and your teachers and your classmates and your roommates, whatever. Um. Okay, so we're gonna start out with like school and going back to school. Um, I'm really excited. Uh, I can't wait to have like a normal school schedule and have my friends here and go to work and just do things and it'll be great. Um, I didn't really have a summer, so I mean I'm not technically going back to school. I'm just starting a new semester, um, which I guess kind of sucks because like summer is pretty important to me and I didn't have that, but whatever. Um, so, let me think. Alright, well, being gay shouldn't matter to your friends because they're your friends, and if being gay, may it's an issue with them, then, like, bro, they're not your friends, drop them, because that's just stupid. Um, with classmates, um... I think if I have any advice on this well okay like I didn't have any problem with that like this past year because I go to school in the city and I mean they're just kind of generally more down with the rainbows in the city pretty much all cities um but I did go to a school out in the middle of nowhere Pennsylvania for the first two years of my college career and uh, it didn't really matter out there like nobody ever gave me shit for it but you know, like, it's just, like, definitely, like, the regular stuff when you go to, like, a new place and, like, nobody's really used to seeing gay people and, like, if you're obviously gay, if you have, like, a shaved head and you dress like a man and you still see your boobs, like, yeah, you know, you're gonna get shit for it, um, or you're just at least gonna get, like, weird looks, but, you know, you're gonna, it kind of, like, toughens you up, though, and you kind of just get used to it, and in the end, it kind of gives you more confidence because you're, like... Bitches be staring at me every day. It's all good. You know why they're staring at you? Because you're hot. That's why. Um, so just keep telling yourself that and you'll get over it. Um, with uh, teachers, you know, I was never, like, discriminated against for being gay by a teacher because, like, that shit's in their code, man. They can't do that. But, um, I don't know. I definitely, like, for some of my papers... For, like, English classes and whatnot, I had, like, choice topic, choice topics, um, about, like, being gay and stuff like that, and some of my teachers, like, you could tell that they were, like, kind of uncomfortable about it, but once they read it and they were, like, oh, yo, alright, that's cool, like, they get over it, you know, like, everything just get everybody just gets over shit in time, you know, um, yeah, I did a speech presentation about being gay and bullying and my professor like loved it and she was like holy roller she had her like three kids and her husband and her little dog and yeah she was 100% like all picket fence America and yeah things were fine like she liked me she didn't hate, she didn't hate on me you know it was good um just be yourself just be yourself don't be don't be like the gay kid, just be yourself. It's all you have to do, and everybody's gonna love you. I promise. Um, let's see what else I have to say about that. Nothing else really. Okay, so the challenge this week was to show a picture of yourself with long hair or whatever have you, and tell everybody why that wasn't you. I wasn't prepared for this. Um, shoot. I don't even know if I want to show you guys these. Um, Alright, I have my school IDs from when I was younger. Just for, like, shits and giggles. Because they're funny. I think. Because of how I look, obviously. Oh, where's my card? I lost my card for work. That's not good. Um, Alright, so... Let me see what can I actually show you here. Um... I don't want to show you that one. I'll show, I don't want to show you that one either. <laughs> Shit, I don't want to show you guys any of these. Um, Alright, well, we're going to... I don't want to show you my name. Alright. 
um, yeah, because I don't want you guys to know my last name or where I went to school. Well, this is in Rhode Island, so it doesn't really matter, I guess. But here we go. We can we can do it this way. All right, cool. So that that's me back in the day. Um, yeah, that was when I was a junior in high school. Um, and then I kind of got a little bit crazy with my hair and shit, and just kind of like let it go all natural. Yeah. Yeah, I was in band. Don't hate. Um, yeah, those are like the only pictures I really have of myself with long hair, because, I mean, that wasn't me, you know? I didn't really like taping photographed back in that day at all. Um, if I can, like, get this back in here. Um, yeah, why was that not me? You know, honestly, it was, but it wasn't. Like, I would... I mean, I would have my long hair again in a heartbeat, but it wouldn't be how it was. I would dread it 100%. I would just dread it and be awesome. Um, yeah, pretty much. Uh... My mom had actually offered, she had said, like, before she buzzed my head, she was just like, are you sure you don't mean to dread it? Like, we can do that, you know? And I kind of, like, regret not taking her up on that, just because, like, I would eventually have a shaved head anyway, like, because you have to cut them all out at some point. But, whatever, it's in the past, it's all done and over with. Um, so why that wasn't me, I mean, like, it was me, but it just wasn't at that time, you know? Like, I was coming into myself, I was like, ah, jeez, this long hair, like, it's... I didn't do anything with it anyway, it was always up, always, always up. Except for those pictures, obviously, because it was picture day, gotta have it down. Um, yeah, it just wasn't me, and I just wasn't feeling it, and I was like, yo, you know what? These cool bitches on YouTube that I watch, and I was watching the L Word at that time. I was like, "Yo, yeah, I just want to buzz my head. Like, fuck it, fuck everything. Just want to chop it all off." So I did, and um, yeah, I'm a better person for it. So go out there, get some clippers, buzz your head. You'll feel great. See you next week, guys.